is disheartening that Kenyans, we only wait for someone to die for us and praise them while we are doing nothing to honor them and celebrate them when they are, they are alive. It is very crucial to, to recognize the selfless and dedicated services by these officers who exhibited unwavering commitment, courage, and sacrifice despite the numerous challenges and risks they face in line of their duties. While I'm requesting through this motion is uh, that we allow these men and women in military to have the privilege of boarding aeroplane, standard gauge railway, and being served in banking hall without being subjected to the routine queues. In doing so, Honorable Speaker, we are going to motivate them to work even, hard, even more in ensuring the peace and harmony prevail in our country. Finally, Honorable Speaker, the work of KDF is not restricted only to Lamu East and West Pokot, but everywhere in this country. In this regard, therefore, I request all members of this House to pass this motion as it is and collaborate with the the Ministry of Transport to come up with the necessary legislation to ensure that legal provision is set to allow, to allow the members of KDF and Special Forces to, to be given a priority in airport and Special Forces to be given a priority in our airports, bus stations, banks, and all other public institutions. They may go they may go to seek service. I therefore urge this House to support this motion. Honorable Speaker, I therefore beg to move and request Major Bashir, Major Bashir to second this motion. Thank you, Honorable Speaker.